Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about limit. So now I will show you how to answer. So we need to do common denominator. About this one, we multiply by tan s. About this one, we multiply by s. So we combine two fractions together and we have tan s minus s. So if we put number 0 going here, here and here, we got about 0 over 0. So we can use about L hospital. That means we need to do first the refer to on numerator and denominator. So first the derivative of tan s, we have secant of s square. First the derivative of s, we have number one. This one we apply about the product rule of the derivative. First the derivative of s square, we have two s. First the derivative of tan s, we have secant of s square. Next, we multiply cosine s square on numerator and denominator. Cosine s square multiplied by secant of s square, we have number 1. Cosine s square multiplied by number 1, we have cosine s square. So we have 1 minus cosine s square. Cosine s square multiplied by tan s. Tan s is about side s over cosine s. So in this situation, we have side s, cosine s. This one we have number 1. Next, we divide both sides by s square. Because we have s, so we just have s in here. Next, 1 minus cosine s square, we change for side s square. And this one we can write into side s over s, everything to the power of 2. So we have the formula in here. The limit of psi s over s when s approach to number 0, we have number 1. So this one we have 1. Psi s over s we have 1. And now we can get the final answer. So this one we have 1. This one we have 1. Cosine of number 0, we have 1. So we have 2 multiplied by 1 by 1. And we simplify and we have 1 over 3 and this is the final answer we need to find in here that is the end thank you for watching